Well, as you all know, I, uh, I met Elvis Presley back in Germany. And, uh, you know, when I returned back to the States, I went right to work. I opened up my own catering company, and I was doing really well. I forgot all about Elvis. Matter of fact, I didn't even listen to rock and roll. I was listening to Benny Goodman, you know, swing. Wasn't really paying attention to what was going on with rock and roll at the time. I get this phone call, and here it's Elvis Presley. He says, WC, you remember me? Well, you know, when I heard his voice, I remembered. I said, hey, Elvis, how you doing? What can I do for you? Well, he said he wanted me, if I was interested in, uh, you know, catering his 1968 comeback special. Well, how could I say no? You know, how could I say no? Of course, of course. So he flew me out, all expenses paid. I didn't have to lift a finger. I didn't even have to get my wallet out. I get there, I set up shop. I make dinner for him and the crew. And, uh, you know, thanks to me and my catering and my skills as a chef, Elvis was a big success that night. A big success, thanks to me. So, you know, years go by, I end up catering for him here and there, Madison Square Garden. I did a couple catering events here in uh, Vegas. And, uh, you know, it was a good time. I really enjoyed myself. And uh, Elvis would always say, WC, you want some jewelry? I'd say, nah, nah. You want a car? He was going to give me a Cadillac. Nah, I don't want no Cadillac. You know, I was just proud. I was proud to, uh, you know, be able to work for Elvis. But one day when I was at Graceland, I was hanging around the house, I saw this hat. This was Elvis's hat. And he was in the army. And I remember him wearing this when I met him. So I said, hey, Elvis, uh, you know, what am I taking that hat? So Elvis said, you know, in his voice, go right ahead and go, go, you know, you can take that hat. So I took the hat. And uh, now every year, every year, Elvis's birthday, I always wear this hat to work. And this is what I work in every year as a, you know, symbolic gesture. You know, I just want to say happy birthday, Elvis Presley. So, uh, old friend of mine, old friend, happy birthday, Elvis. Uh, yeah, that's it. You can cut it. Cut. Yeah.